listen, check it out now. Holy! Now, if y'all haven't listened to that new NBA Young Boys tape, it's called uh, Our Colors. Man, that junk go hard, man. Why well, be really better out here, okay? However, man, I'm not gonna lie, man. He got all type of disses on the junk. He's not even throwing subliminals no more. Straight overt. He's getting at people directly. Now, I'm also gonna be honest, because Quando Rondo's on the tape too. They just clowning Vaughn. I'm like, there's no way to explain it. They're just clowning him. Now, um, first of all, there's a song called Gangsta, right? Which, which Quando Rondo is actually featured on, and he says this. He said, listen, man, 300 bands later, I still ain't drop, and y'all united. They say little Tim, the biggest op, stepped on that boy, don't do no fighting, yellow tape, Glocks, Max, and Carbons, fuck the industry, don't like us, 200 grand out for your pockets, like, fuck that, let me buy the body. They know we really bout it, bout it. Straight whatever, no Playboy, Cardi, God Damn it. Now, uh, listen, young boy also gave some shout outs to Lil Tim as well. Okay. He says this, uh, on, this is on a track called, uh, no switch. He says, they know I don't give a fuck. They know they don't want to see Lil Tim jump from out that truck. They know Quando rolling like them sixties buck. He put you up. No, I'm a thug ass nigga out that North and I'm a throw it up. And I'm in that bitch. I whack that bitch, but innocent. I buy my baby mama anything because I'm really rich, okay? Now, it's clear. You know, um, they're pretty much going to rock with their guy, which is obviously Lil' Tim. Lil' Tim, if you don't know, this is a guy who jumped out of the truck and shot Vaughn fatally after Vaughn got into a fist fight with uh, Quando Rondo in Atlanta. And basically, it has divided both crews, OTF, also the, the guys over at 4K Trey. And you can tell by the raps here, they're rocking with Lil' Tim, all right? now. I'm wondering how this is going to play out because it, like a couple months ago when Youngboy was kind of like locked up or not commenting, everybody hated Quando. Everybody hated Tim. Why? Because they loved uh, King Vaughn. However, when Youngboy is now basically co-signing the actions of Lil Tim, do people have a change of opinion or a change of heart on the situation? You know, I've said before, if King Vaughn or one of King Von's people did what Lil Tim did, I think they would be championing King Von. You know why? They like King Von more than they like Quando Rondo. However, because it was on the other side, it basically people aren't that happy. I'm wondering when a more popular rapper like Youngboy basically, you know, keeps shouting out Lil Tim and basically standing behind it, I'm wondering how that'll change perception. Now, you could also hear from Quando, like he's basically accepting it. It's really 4K Trade versus the industry. And what does that mean? Man, a lot of you ain't gonna see here a lot of features. You're not gonna see a lot of opportunities. They're not gonna be on shows with people. Basically, people are realizing they gotta pick a side. And and right now, it seems like being on the side of Lil Durk seems to be more popular. There's more popular rappers over there. There's more mainstream people over there. And people kind of just look at young boys like a wild card. You can't control them. So hey, how about just stay out of his way? Or if you have to pick a side, pick the other side. What do you guys think about all of this? But clearly, young boy isn't that sorry for what went down. If anything, he's poking fun at it. And he's shouting out little Tim, all right? What do you guys think of this? Get in the comment box, put you guys like and subscribe. What do you also think about his album? Give me a rating from 1 to 10 in the comment section. It's working, dummies.